stops and avalanches or races down the hill. You can try and stop the seasons, girl, but you know you never will. You can try and stop my dancing feet, but I just cannot stand still. Cause the world keeps spinning. The motion of the ocean, of the sun and the sky If you wonder if you wanna, but I'll never ask why If you try to hold me down, I'm gonna spit in your eye and say You can't stop the beat You can't stop the river as it rushes through the sea Try to stop the ends of time, but you know it just can't be. If they try to stop the seaweed, we got the end of an ACP. Cause the world keeps spinning round and round, and my heart even tied to the speed of sound. I was lost till I heard the drums and I found my way. You can't stop the beat ever since you first saw the light. And then a moment like you shake it off on Saturday night. I'm gonna shake it, shimmy it with all of my mind today You can't stop the motion of the ocean or the rain from above You can try to stop the paradise by dreaming up But you can't stop the rhythm of your heart's been in love today You can't stop the beat oh, 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 oh. Ever since we first saw the sun I met a woman like the shake it when the day Dave Galair, Banach Tio Klaus de Verkhoed, Falsha Rove Quigar Nihan and Naradam, Fe Fe Hain, Ocod Vorn de Blena, Fe Fe Hain, Blin Du Hanak Agus Yakar, Ak Blin Hatnavak, Splodrak Agus Rahul, Kyaun de Le Riamar, or Luchana All in the Scholar Show, Mass, Makontakt, Koi Bru Agus Irakt. Hello, everybody, and welcome to the Awards Night 2021 here in Klaus de Verkhoed. 2021 has been a very different and challenging year, but it has also been a year where we have shown the best of our core values. Respect, honesty, cooperation and effort. Today we celebrate the safe and successful completion of the school year and also the outstanding achievements of our students. These students have demonstrated excellence in perseverance, adaptability and resilience. Trasliam Liv Goler, Kridigi Imanana Skola, Ra'a Seher. I congratulate you all you have captured the essence of our school motto here in Clos de Verroquaid, success through effort. I now hand you over to Miss Carr. Glashka is also known as the President's Award. It is an award for personal achievement in three areas and is presented by the President of Ireland, Michael D. Higgins. Students take part in three, three different activities over 26 weeks under the following headings. Physical activity is where many of our students this year took part in sport. Personal skill, where some students learn music, for example. And finally, community involvement, where many of our students undertake volunteer work. I would like to send my congratulations to the following students who completed their bronze award this year, despite the restrictions surrounding them. Congratulations to Caitlin Ryan. Kaylee Cronin. James Casey.
John Shaw. James Gleason. Owen Craddock. Nathan Keenahan. and Stephen Marr. I would also like to wish these students the very best of luck, as some of them have now chosen to continue their journey with the Silver Award. Next up is the BT Young Scientist. The BT Young Scientist competition takes place in January each year to celebrate students across Ireland and their work in science. This year, we had three students who completed research and created two different projects. In the senior category, Caitlin Ryan and Kayleigh Cronin created a project linked to our school energy programme, where they created an app. In the intermediate category, third year student Susie Ryan completed a project on the area of smartphones and social media and their impact on our mental health. Congratulations to all three students on their incredible work over the last few months. Congratulations to Caitlin Ryan, and Kayleigh Cronin, and also to Susie Ryan. SciFest is a science competition run in association with our local college, LIT Thurless Campus. This year we had three projects which were submitted from our school. Caitlin Ryan and Kayleigh Cronin completed a project on the energy programme. Susie Ryan completed a project on smartphones and their impact on our health. And Sarah Ryan in second year completed a project on the impact of vitamin B12 deficiency on the body. And she explained how trends associated with vegan and vegetarian diets are now causing more people to have vitamin B12 deficiency in Ireland. Well done to these four girls for their incredible work throughout the year on these three very interesting projects. I will now call the girls forward for their certificates. Caitlin Ryan. Kelly Cronin Susie Ryan and Sarah Ryan I will now pass you over to Miss Bergen for the next award so our first uh, category here is the Student Enterprise Awards category and this year we're giving it to Cormac Kiley who won third prize in the intermediate category of the Student Enterprise County Final with his Beehive business. Well done Cormac. And he also came third last year so he's very entrepreneurial. So well done. So our next award is the Colossus de Wera Coed Entrepreneurial Spirit Award. And this year it's going to Kayleigh Cronin and Caitlin Ryan. They have um, transformed our energy wellbeing app into an, um, our program into an online app. They used the Thunkable programming language to develop the energy app. And um, they had the support from a number of teachers and from mentors in Teen Turn, which promotes tech for girls. And they've been working on this for over a year and they have spent a lot of their free time working on it with the aim of helping other students in our school. And just to name some of the awards the girls have won, they won the Young Innovators Award in the Teen Turn SciFest and received Beats headphones. They won the best online business in the senior category of the Student Enterprise County Final. And just last weekend, they entered the Coolest Projects International competition and it's the world's leading uh, technology showcase for young people. And they'll compete with students from all over the world. So well done to Kaylee and Caitlin. Um, so our next award then is the Scratch National Final TY category. And we had two uh, students who made it to the national final. So um, we have Aaron McNamara and Kevin Fitzgerald. Well done. 
So they both uh, made different games. Kevin's game was dodgeball and Aaron's was game over. And they used lots of coding concepts, so well done, lads. They're both uh, TY students. So the next category then is our second year uh, coding games FLA. So this year, for the first time ever, we had a games FLA with Boris the Cane Community College, whereby we linked up with uh, Miss Davina Forty, a past pupil of mine, and our students created scratch games and arcade games, and so did the, school, the second years in Boris the Cane. And their students then voted on the best games from our school. So they picked uh, the first prize was for Ethan Taylor, who made a snake game in Scratch. Well done, Ethan. And then the second game that won was uh, the Temple game by Aaron Cummins, and he used Microsoft Arcade. Well done, Aaron. So well done, lads. Very good. The next award we have is a, our Teen Turn Programming Awards, which is Tech for Girls, and it's an after-school program. Um, we link in with mentors from uh, Merck, Sharp and Dome, Microsoft, Intel, Vodafone. And we meet once a week and work on their app and their business plan. Um, the girls were encouraged to look at the 17 UN goals on sustainable development and they choose goal three, which is good health and based on well-being. So Sarah uh, Ryan and Rebecca Jordan made uh, their app Late Sleepers, which is designed to um, set an alarm and to stop the alarm, you have to play a game. Then, um, th that's, uh, that's the award for that, so well done, girls. And to our digital champions, well done to Patrick Cawley. Well done, Patrick. Sarah Ryan. Well done to Gavin McNamara and Enda Wickham. Well done, Enda. Thank you. Hi, I'm Mr. Brennan, the first year year head in Colossia and I'm here to present the first year student of the year award. The student of the year award goes for excellence in academics, for excellence in online learning, and for their overall participation in all aspects of school life in Claustewera. This year I'm delighted to announce that the award goes to Grace Ann Maher in 1D. So well done Grace, um, richly deserved and a fabulous achievement. So well done again. I'm now going to hand you over to our second year year head, Miss Cahill. Good evening. Our second year year head is my great pleasure to announce Lily Rose Sayers as Student of the Year in second year in CMCO. Lily is truly deserving of this award. She's a dedicated and diligent student. She espouses all that is best in her studies at class and with her homework, but she also shares her talents with others and adds considerably to life here in the school. On behalf of her teachers and the management of the school, Bavralum, Co-Gardicus A.N. of La Lily Rose. I would now like to hand over to Mr. Dari Fahey, August um, is Canaran a triably in a Dara. Garmagwith, thank you. The winner of the third year student of the year has contributed to school life in this very challenging year. They've worked hard to reach their potential across all subjects. They represented the school on the national stage in the BT Young Scientist and they also contributed to the school newsletter. It gives me great pleasure to announce Susie Ryan as the winner of the third year student of the year. I'll now hand over to Miss Geeney. Thanks, Mr. Fahey. And hi, everybody. I'm delighted to be here uh, tonight to announce the winners of the TY uh, student of the year and international student of the year. It's my um, great pleasure to present the student of the year to a student who has embraced all the opportunities and the challenges that this year has shown in TY. Um, they have participated excellently and always um, shown the school core values at the heart of everything that they do. This student is Amy Ryan. And next up then for our TY International Student of the Year, again, a student who has really impressed all the teaching staff here in Colossia Vera with uh, their attitude and their effort that they have put in this year. 
it has been a really tough year and I'm, I'm sure it's been really tough to be away from their home country as well for the full year. But they have really have embedded themselves in, in Kloshever and in their TY class and have had a great year. And they've really added to the experience for the rest of the students here. And I'm delighted to say this student is Fabio Duina. Hello everyone and welcome again to the Student of the Year Awards. Um, I'm very fortunate to be senior year head in Colossia Wear Co-ed because of the great group of people that we have in fifth and sixth year. That's why this year's fifth year competition was so difficult and also, strangely, it was also so easy. You're all aware of the year we've had and the trials and tribulations we've faced, but you faced them with us. You live it up to your side of the bargain. You showed up online, dealt with Wi-Fi issues, slow internet and all the rest. This year's fifth year student of the year is a young man who embodies the spirit of Kalosh to wear a co-ed. This young man embodies the spirit of student voice in our school. And this young man embodies the spirit of everything positive in our school. This young man is Nathan Keenan. Congratulations, Nathan. So as LCA coordinator, I will be announcing both the fifth and sixth year LCA awards. So starting with fifth year. So at the end of a strange school year for everyone, I would first like to say a very well done to all the fifth year LCA class. The LCA teachers would like to commend the class as a whole for their hard work during the year, and especially during the online teaching period. It is always a difficult task to pick one student from a group, and I have to say it was a close call this year. But for his sheer hard work and effort, Combined with his impeccable courtesy, I am very pleased to announce the recipient of the fifth LCA Student of the Year is Jack Ryan. This time we come to our sixth years and what a set of experiences and memories this group will have to look back on. They've studied several subjects. They were participants and spectators at many sports events, school tours at home and abroad, school musicals, choirs, performances on campus and in our community, young scientists and multiple activities and competitions that are way too numerous for me to mention. And then you have to deal with a global pandemic. Enough said about that, I think. So our sixth year student of the year, again, a very difficult decision for our staff, so many worthy candidates, but one shone through. This young woman epitomizes everything positive in our school. A young person who lives our motto and is the embodiment of our core values, respect, honesty, effort, and cooperation. Our sixth year student of the year has had excellent reports since first year and has been a first class friend to our entire year group. She's enthralled us on many occasions in the choir and on stage where she has commanded many lead roles. At our open evenings and under normal circumstances, I have no doubt she would have had entertained us again today. Parents, staff, students, our sixth year student of the year 2001, Kloshtawera Coed, is the highly respected and wonderful Miss Rebecca Rose Elphick. Thank you very much. Moving on to sixth LCA. And again, before announcing the recipient of the LCA Student of the Year Award, I would first like to congratulate all the sixth year students who graduate this year from the LCA programme. The group have been exemplary in their attitude towards their work and in their behaviour and responsibility as seniors in the school. So the choice of student of the year has been a difficult one. However, one student has been chosen not only for her work ethic and attitude in sixth year, but throughout her six years in CMCO. Always pleasant and cooperative and willing to help in her quiet, dignified way, this student has contributed to the life of CMCO, particularly in a musical way, a constant in our school choir and in our school musicals as a lead. I am very pleased to announce the 2021 sixth LCA Student of the Year is Rose Shanahan. And now I will hand you on to Mr. Gleeson. This year's Engineering Project of the Year Award goes to a student who has excellent practical skills and also an excellent understanding of engineering principles and processes. His project this year was manufactured to 
a very high standard and this student is Sebastian Spieszkowski. I now hand you over to Mr. Power for the Construction Studies Award. Uh, this year's Frank Dewan Award for, Pro for Construction Studies Project of the Year is going to a student who has excelled in both practical and uh, project construction is Jack Kendi. Well done, Jack. Um, I'm now going to pass you on to Miss Martin for the Language Award. The LIT Language Award is presented every year to a student who shows the skill, dedication and natural flair for learning languages. This year I am proud to announce the winner as Grace Anne Marr, First Year D. Félicitations et bravo! I'll now hand you over to Miss Cahill for the Irish Award. Dieve, Harkown Ryan Naguelga, Bavine Lum, Gradam Naguelga Vrana, Er Daniel Slatra. Da Danny Sashio Blean. Is Boka Leafa, Deshvelak, Ildanak, Kumasaki Danny. A Yen and a Kion, her son of Guelga, August her son Kultur and Guelga Iguitna. Far more sport, far more Kyol, far more Guelga E. August the Willer Intenege, Dolomon Tor up to Makansa. So Kogardicus let Danny, August Tipperdarden, Abu. Gurmagwif. Our next award tonight is the JCSP Make a Book Award and here to collect this award and representing each of the four first year classes, um, we have four students who are represented the school at the Make a Book Virtual um, Showcase uh, last month. Here they showcased the, our digital book that we made um, using equipment that we were able to buy through JCSP this year. And, for our Christmas celebration, all first year students made a video showing the their life in first year during a pandemic in Clóisevera. So I'm delighted to have four of our first years here uh, tonight uh, to collect these awards. So first up is Grace Maher, Adam Phelan, Aaron Connolly, and Niall Ryan. And our next award, and on behalf of the JCSP core team, I'm very happy to be presenting three representatives from our third year cohort with their JCSP profile this evening. These are being presented to all third years in recognition of work that they have um, completed between first and third year as part of the Junior, Scar Junior Cert Schools programme. And first up, representing 3A is Kiran Kavna. Representing 3B is John Marr. And representing 3C, Sarah Murphy. The past 14 months have been a very different and strange experience for music students here in Kalashtawira Coed. However, students have risen to the challenges that COVID-19 has presented and kept music alive in the school through virtual concerts, talent competitions and developing solo skills. Two third year students in particular have shown their commitment and dedication to the music department over the past year and it is with great pride that I present music awards to Ben Nolan and Sophie MacDonald. The recipient of this year's Senior Music Award has played leading roles in school productions of Hairspray, Bring It On, Grease and Little Shop of Horrors. This student, as part of the school choir, has represented the school at Limerick Choral Festival, Shine, Tipperary ETB talent competitions and our intergenerational choir with Padre Pio. Not only is she a talented singer, but an accomplished piano player. It, was, it is with great pride that I award this year's Senior Music Award to Rebecca Elphick. The relationship between school attendance and students reaching their potential is well established. This year was a difficult year for all and in spite of these circumstances, the attendance this year has been excellent. I want to commend all the students for their attendance during the online learning post Christmas. 
I also want to congratulate the 44 students from first year to sixth year who did not miss a day in school this year. It's an excellent achievement, well done. And finally, a special congratulations to sixth year student Ellen Clark, who once again had, did not miss a day this year. That is six years in Kalosh the Wirra Coed without missing a school day. That is 1,002 days of full attendance. Well done, Ellen, and congratulations. I'd like to hand over now to Miss Byrne. Thank you, Mr. Vai. Kalosh Mura Coed prides itself on promoting positive mental health and wellbeing among our staff and students. We do this through our whole school wellbeing programme called the Energy Programme. Energy is an acronym and stands for E for exercise, N for nutrition, E for exhale and inhale of the breath, R for random acts of kindness and G for good things and Y for your internet safety. As a school community, students are encouraged to participate in specific challenges over the academic year. This was done both remotely and when students were in school. This next award recognises in particular students participating in the E for exercise challenge where students were asked to get out and get active for at least 20 minutes for two weeks. These students showed great determination in not only completing the task for the two weeks of the challenge, but who endeavoured to continue to get out and get active after the challenge was complete. It was difficult to narrow it down as some students were very close on the leaderboard. I would like to congratulate from first year, Michael Canan and Christina Carroll. From second year, Gavin McNamara and Rebecca Jordan. And from third year, Patrick O'Donnell and Susie Ryan. May your contribution to promote, promoting health and wellbeing in Colossal continue as you progress your studies and encourage others to join in on the process. Well done to all involved. And I'll now hand you over to Mr Stapleton. Um, my name is Mr Stapleton and uh, I'm delighted to be able to award the Mary Dell Award to a brilliant student, uh, somebody with a fantastically positive attitude over the years. Um, brilliant attendance. He, he wanted to be in school even when we had holidays or when we were in the lockdown, he was mad to be back. Uh, so sociable to all students, teachers, puts a smile on everybody's face. And really the feedback always was, he was so brilliant to, um, so brilliant to, to teach and to be around. And his nature was infectious around the school. So it's my pleasure to award the Mary Dell Award to Stephen Cullen. Uh, thank you very much, and I'll now hand it on to Miss Wallace. Thank you, Mr. Stapleton. And I would also like to congratulate Stephen on winning the Mary Delahunty Award. I would also like to acknowledge that Stephen's graduation will be especially significant for Miss Olivia Ryan, Miss Geraldine Cahill, and Miss Mary Murray. It is now my great pleasure to present the Roth Os Seher Award. The Roth Os Seher Spirit of Kalosh de Wirra Award is presented to students in sixth year who, based on their effort grades over fifth and sixth year, are considered to have made the best effort in senior cycle. In Kalosh de Wirra Coed, we operate around four core values. They are respect, cooperation, honesty and effort. Our school motto is Roth Os Seher, and that translates as success through effort. In each reporting cycle, our students are asked to self-report and negotiate target grades with their teachers. Teachers also award effort grades, and these grades reflect how a student's work and diligence has allowed them to achieve their target grades. This Rathos Seher Award has been determined by collating the effort grades of all our senior students. I do hope that the hard work and diligence of the recipient of this award pays off and that he will achieve the grades he needs to study business in college. It is fantastic when a student goes on to study a course you've done yourself and I really hope he will enjoy it as much as I did. We wish this student well and we thank him most sincerely for the leadership and support he has given to his teachers and fellow students through the years. 
I am delighted that the recipient of the Rath Os Seher Award for the 2021 academic year from Colosh to Wirrakoed goes to Jamie Canaan. Congratulations, Jamie. We've just arrived here in Clanny Ross in the parish of Ross Moor, in the home of Michael and Marie Slattery, who are the parents of Danny Slattery, who's been a student in our school for the last six years. Let's hope Danny is in this evening. Hello, Danny. Come on out. Oh, what is going on? God's sake. Oh, no. Well, Danny, at least you're not in the trouble. You know you're not in trouble, eh? <laughs> Come out here. Who's inside there with you? We're absolutely to be delighted to be out here in Ross Moore this evening on a lovely evening like this and to be coming out with... Um, on the night of the awards ceremony in Colossal World, which is a very big evening for us, each year I have the Principal's Award to give out, which is when we look back at a student's performance and how they worked over the last six years with us in the school, how um, they engaged with everybody, how they came in with a smile, how they got on with the work, etc. And you look back and Danny, I'm proud to say and delighted to say you're the recipient of the Principal's Award for Colossal a Coed for the year of 2021. So congratulations. <laughs> and after that then, I was going to see, Danny, have you, is there anything you'd like to say? Oh God, <laughs> oh, I'm absolutely speechless. Oh God. First time Danny Slattery is speechless. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, thanks very much. He's like, a bad thing to say about the school and no, it's, uh, it's a pleasure really six years ah oh, she it has done really enough thanks very much god on me okay danny well well thank 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 you very much and we haven't a bad thing to say about you either i'm delighted to say so i suppose with that i'd just like to say a few words about the principal's award and about danny's life in colostra coed danny slattery came through the gates of colostra in 2015 and immediately became known as your man at the hurley from Clonodley. Although he'd often correct me here with a smile saying it's Clonodley. Danny always had a hurley by his side and despite at that time being small in stature, he would be available for matches irrespective if it was under 15, 16 or 18 and never minded being asked to mark the bigger guy. He never shirked responsibility. I suppose what I'm saying here is that Danny Slattery had a most positive attitude and mindset from those earliest days as a student here. This was to transcend into the classroom, where Danny always transpired to be a joy to teach, homework always done, notes taken down immaculately and consistently, and behaviour was exemplary. Although there may have been a few demerits, I think, Danny loves to chat. Other memories I have of Danny. In TY, Danny played the lead role in our school musical at Greece. The dress rehearsal was on the same Sunday as the county semi-final between Danny's beloved Clonalty and Tommy Vera. I informed the musical director not to expect Danny in the dome, but to my surprise, as Clonalty beat tune, Danny was belting the hits out on the stage. It is a measure of Danny that he would not let the side down. Danny is talented musically. Even during roll call each morning, Himself along with Harry and Cormac will be singing and listening to the best of the 80s to bands like Neil Diamond and the Bangles and his class tutor will attest to this. On the GA field, Danny proudly represented our school at all levels, winning Munster medals and playing leading roles on the pitch in football and hurling, always encouraging those around him like a true leader and captain. 
One of my proudest days was seeing Danny represent Tipperary in this year's minor Munster Hurling final, where he was without question man of the match. Attitude, as they say, is everything in sport. Danny has this in spades, both on the field and off it. Danny, after leaving CERT, will be pursuing a career in primary teaching as he intends to study at Mary Ian Limerick. I wish him the very best in his studies and I know he will make a brilliant teacher. It's well for the national school that will get him. It has been an honour to have had Danny as a student at Colossal where co for six years. It is my privilege to announce that this year's Principal's Award goes to the fantastic young man, Danny Slattery. Okay, it gives me great pleasure, Danny, to present you with the Perpetual Trophy for the Principal's Award for Colossal Borough co 2021. And we have a small gift to give you as well. And with that, thank you. And we'll see you soon. Thank you very much. In conclusion to our 2021 CMCO Awards Night, I would like to again congratulate all our worthy recipients. I would also like to thank all the management and staff of the school who have made this event possible. A special word of thanks to Ms Purtle and the TYTV crew of Ethan, Stephen, Daniel, Kevin and Aaron. It is said that a society can be judged on how it treats its most vulnerable and we could not be prouder of our CMCO students and their care and resilience shown in these recent turbulent times. They have completely embodied our school motto, Ra a Seher, success through effort. Stay safe everybody and Sloan live. We will leave you now with a performance from our school choir. The students and staff of the music and drama departments were so disappointed not to be performing on stage in our annual show this year. We will, however, come back home and have recorded this song to reflect that. Led by Reen Power, this is From Now On. Enjoy. I saw the sun begin to dim and felt that winter wind blow cold. A man learns who is there for him when the glitter fades and the walls won't hold. Cause from them rubble, what remains can only be what's true. If all was lost, there's more I gained. Cause it led me back. to you. From now on, these eyes will not be blinded by the lies. From now on, what's waited till tomorrow starts tonight, tonight. Let this promise in me start Like an anthem in my heart From now on From now on Drank champagne with kings and queens The politicians praised my name But those are someone else's dreams The pitfalls of the man that I became For years and years I chased their cheers The crazy speed of always needing more but when I stop and see you here, I remember who all this was for. From now on, these eyes will not be blinded by us. From now on, what's waited till tomorrow starts tonight? It starts tonight. Let this promise in me start Like an 